This is Bob. He may not look like much, but back in the day, Bob had some big dumb dreams, which didn't quite work out. Now Bob's a broke ass, and he needs every hack in the book to survive. This is Broke Ass Bob's Guide to Spa Day. $5 a month on toilet paper? That's excessive. Our neighbors throw away tons of perfectly good newspaper. You look stressed. You know what you need? A day of unwinding at a fancy spa. Really? Oh, that would be fantastic. Whoa, what the f Bob? A spa day means expensive massages, costly mani-pedis, and those mud baths with cucumbers on your eyes ain't cheap, pal. They charge you for the cucumbers, too? Yeah, it's gonna cost you at least $200. That's over twice what you've got in the bank. When do we go? We're already there. Suave, Bob. Real suave. Okay, if you're gonna pull off this at-home health spa thing, your lady will need the appropriate attire. Throw a bathrobe in the washer with some white vinegar. Then drop a couple tennis balls in the dryer. One fluff cycle later, that ragged robe is a super soft spa grade wrap. For me? Tomorrow. Oh, such a generous lover. Now that your ever patient partner has settled in, Ooh. let's cover up the old sweaty sock smell permeating your broke ass bedroom. By heating up some water and lavender oil in an old thrift store mug, Slobby Bobby hacks an aromatherapy diffuser for cents on the dollar. <sighs> All right, what do you say we get this massage rolling? Wow, that's literal. But applying a rolling pin to tense muscles is certainly one way to knead out pesky knots. Who needs to shell out big bucks for massage tools? Or pay a strapping six foot tall Swedish masseuse named Sven $150 an hour to put his hands all over your girlfriend? <laughs> Not me, that's who. Of course, no spa day is complete without a pedicure, but something tells me you're not the type to foot the bill for that, are you, Bob? That's just what the big foot industry wants you to do. To fight back against big foot, Bob hacks a minty foot bath by combining mouthwash and vinegar in a sandwich bag. Then, for some extra exfoliation, he rubs a lemon in coarse salt. Plus, I can even use it to scrub the dirty dishes. But I won't. Gotta give you some credit, Bob. Your broke-ass beauty hacks actually worked. This spa day only cost you about 20 bucks. How was everything? It was great. But don't use those lemons to scrub the dirty dishes. Oh, seriously, don't. You'll get athlete's mouth. 